Good morning, fam. It is currently, I don't know, it's freaking early. Ooh, la la. Oh, oh wow. Right through in a hatchback, juked out in that all black, move five two on a snapback, cause I moved that, son, I own that. They freaking left me. Oh, heck no. I'm not gonna allow them to believe me. Empire, that's building up. Got a lot of cake. They left me. So now that I've been left, I have to walk for some reason. Whenever I end up walking somewhere, not purposefully, I get rained on. Get enough. Hot dog, and I'm catching up. Y'all better start on resting up. We the ones who we do the icy one. Girl, you better put some clothes on. It's cold outside. It's cold. You gotta pay to park your bike? What? The finger's healing up nicely. Yes. Dirty, bitch, kill me. You were blind to it, now you feel me. That's braille, that's real. Doing bigger numbers than your major deal. You still All of the clothing that you've been seeing me wear, the driven, make it count, the new joggers, the new dad hats, all of those will be released. We're trying to have them on the 15th. Stay tuned. It's coming soon. Tip of the day. Always, when you go out somewhere far, far away, Find a Whole Foods, find a grocery store, get something small. I got rice, got kale, got broccoli, and then I got a big old chicken. All it cost me was $11. That's it. If you eat right, you feel right. Hey, Pops. Hey. What you, hello. Update on the finger. It looks like crap. What's up guys? So I am here with Max Tuning and we're about to do something like that Cuba Gooding I... Jr. <laughs> he literally thinks he's a pilot right now. But anyways, um, I have never created a uh, podcast before. It's my first time doing so and I wanted to invite Max on my podcast for the first time ever. Actually, I've never interviewed anybody else before. So it's gonna be super, super fun. You're gonna learn more about him. I'll let everyone know about the release of the podcast very soon, but for now, let's jump right into it. What would you recommend for someone who is maybe in high school or maybe in college and struggling with the idea of, well, if I don't do this, then I won't be able to make a living or I won't be able to live the life that I've always dreamt of as a at a really really young age what would you say to someone like that I, I would tell someone that like and you hear it all the time like anything is possible you can be whatever you want to be and I, th I think we're at a time and age where um, that has never been more of a true statement than before um, just you know you no longer need to climb you know the corporate ladder to, to be successful in what you do. What is poppin' fam? We are here at District Barbell, Washington, D.C., a.k.a. Max Tuning's gym, and I wanted to just go through a few different movements that I was doing in today's workout. Also, just talk about how maybe you could be training or implement certain movements that I'm doing into your actual training system. So with my warm-ups, I always try to superset it with some muscle-ups or inverted rows or some back exercise, and then I get straight into my actual heavy sets. So here I'm doing 200. 85 pounds, keeping my butt down. That's the most important. Four sets of three. Remember, just two months ago, I was doing 245 pounds for just three reps because of my shoulder. I'm getting a lot stronger. I'm getting exactly where I want to be. But the way I train is with these compound movements, I generally don't superset it with anything else, especially if I'm going heavier, if I'm going lighter, then of course, go ahead and superset it with a bodyweight movement. Think more biceps or back exercises, nothing anteriorly. And then from here, I generally go to some type of dog. <laughs> no, I'm totally kidding. This pit bull was just beautiful. I wanted to record it. Um, but I do go to some accessory work. I do some pull-ups. I'll do a back movement, trying to be explosive. So here, doing 90 pounds. It's hard for me to grip on that left hand because of my finger. You'll see me drop right here. I just couldn't hang on because of that nail that's all messed up, but that finger that's all messed up. But I take this movement and then I go to a bodyweight movement that's challenging. And then I go to another bodyweight movement that's challenging. So generally two to three different types of exercises like this, working on anterior delts, raising those hips up, making sure that I'm still extended in that elbow. This is going to help me with my planche. And that's what I'm really working towards using all these different exercises, which are especially found in my Iron Body program. You could check that out if you would like to. But 
I try and just focus on getting my plant stronger, my handstand push-ups stronger, my explosive push-ups, every movement, front lever, back lever that you could be doing bodyweight training-wise, that's what I like to focus on. So when you're going into the gym and you want to become stronger, do cooler tricks on the bars, think the same way I am. But also, I like to train this way because I hit strength, power, hypertrophy, which is the size of your muscles, and muscular endurance, which means I'm going to get leaner and build more muscle day in and day out. This is a very challenging exercise, by the way. Make sure you try this in the gym yourself. But that's generally what I focus on, getting leaner, getting stronger, being more powerful. I try and hit all phases of training so that it's different from everybody else. I enjoy my workouts. They're an hour and 15 minutes, and that's all I need. So definitely do this type of training if you can, and also check out Iron Body when you get a chance. All right, boys. All right, brother. Are you out, dude? Cali, yeah, the Cali smack. I gotta go to dinner with my family. Oh, that's cool. I don't see that. No? You smell that? It's alcohol. Oh, yeah, you got some black label in here, baby. What? What is this? Gains. That's lamb, isn't it? I will not eat it. I will not eat the lamb. I'll eat that, though. All right. So what do you think? That was good. good? Yeah, that's good. Oh, yeah, nice fluid movement. Yeah, nice fluid movement. Yeah. You want to? Whoa, 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 whoa. The main thing I learned today was don't drink wine and play golf. It doesn't work very well. You can't really see the ball. My sister just shanked it. <laughs> they ain't done it like this where I'm from. Went home, I seen rappers coming up. Look at what we did, doing what we done. I went home, everybody showing love. It's a whole new world showing up. What's a whole different path? Dude, did you say you could dance? Yeah, I can dance. Huh? Oh my god, hold on. Went home just to open up a show. Little lick at me, I was on a roll. Cool with me, supposed to get him in for free. Bouncing with the tickets, didn't know me. Snapped on him like old decks on 5 volt grinds. Second that, I realized how much that the ego blinds. Apologize for that, my bad, I must lost my cap Everybody got a dark side, sometimes the empire gotta strike back But I feel like I'm the new hope, episode 2, y'all be the clones My future set in that carbonite like What's your YouTube channel? What's your YouTube channel? No, Yao24, aka Yao Cow. look for me Check, yeah, look for him Look for me Look with your eyes, but type with your fingers, make sure you're typing Some people use drugs, <laughs> I use chocolate <laughs> Smooth and relaxed. Nice. Mom, what are you doing? You just chugging it? <laughs> chugging it? What if I'm uh, reading a new book? It's absolutely lit. I had to. 21 irrefutable laws of being a leader. That's what it's all about in the end. How can you be a better leader? Green juice, baby, start off the day right. If you eat right, you feel right. <laughs> <laughs> um, yesterday, um, yeah, they have no problem. <laughs> I do not discriminate when it comes to alcohol. I treat all the alcohol the same with respect, with dignity, and I drink them. This view. This view though. This view though is freaking awesome. Stone Tower Winery, awesome place. If you're ever in Virginia or Washington DC, definitely come out here, try some wine. Very, very tasty. Uh, if you are someone who knows anyone that does collaborations or is like a part of an agency that works with resorts, hotels, or housing in different states, in the United States or around in like a different country, let's say like, I don't know, in Russia or Germany or the UK or I, wherever, I would love to connect with them because I want to create videos, vlogs like this or episodes all around the world and I want to connect with and make collaborations with this person that person that's why you know me and Max hung out we're friends one two we wanted to create a podcast my first ever podcast for you guys so that'll be up I'll give you an announcement on that um, we also wanted to train together and we wanted to just make a cool YouTube video for you guys and that's exactly what we did and a lot of people liked it so 
If you know anyone that deals with any of that type of stuff, definitely let me know. And then also, if you enjoy these type of videos, comment below, hashtag calisthenics, and give me a thumbs up. Give me a thumbs up for the video. I'm putting a lot of work into these because they're just, they're just freaking awesome. I love doing this, it's so cool. Timothy wants to be on the vlog. I'm gonna give him the, the just the moment of fame. Here we go, it's, <laughs> it's happening. It's about to happen. That's Timothy. Timothy, take, take it away. <laughs> take it away. Killing me, man. It's been a long time coming. Wait, this is this is actually Why? happening. Yeah. We are here, about to do a podcast. Me and the pops. We are actually in a gym. <laughs> That's what you do when you don't have a studio across the country. That's just it. Just go away with my time.